Today, prayers are answered for WBU's Eagle Farms because the structures that you see behind me, the structures that we will dedicate this morning, are crucial to growing in the next phase of Eagle Farms. Personally, both Kevin and I uh, are incredibly moved that these two lives that were cut way too short will be continually remembered uh, as you walk through those doors and as you find new life, as you find no less than God's blessing through the life he gives in the plants and the things that you take off onto the farm and uh, the education that you receive, the investment that they represent in your lives and, uh, and your futures. Both of us and our families and our company are behind you 100%. These greenhouses have given us one small place to put our grief and put our love so that their memory will carry on. So one of the things that I've looked at differently since uh, 2017 would be butterflies. I think of butter a lot of times butterflies are the rebirth of something or it means change. Spiritually, it's the rebirth that we find in Christ. So as you grow things in these greenhouses, I pray that the greenhouses will give you um, shelter and a place to protect and grow um, these plants. But selfishly, I really hope the plants bring on the butterflies. The connection of these two families is now further strengthened in the memories of two very precious family members now physically, visibly commemorated on our campus. Again, on behalf of the Williams Baptist University, I want to thank the Russell family and the Wilcutt family for your gracious and generous support to make these greenhouses possible here today.